Your home is burning. 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 I got the uh, Arduino Uno board for this project, beautiful project. Welcome to TME Education. Education. So DF Player Mini. DF Player Mini is a audio player module with a simplified output directly connected to the speaker. This device supports files like MP3, WAV file, and WMA file. On top of the uh, DF Player Mini, we have a SD card adapter. It supports SD cards with capacity up to 32 gigabytes. The format of your SD card should be FAD16 and FAD32. You can power the DF Player Mini with a 3.2 volt or 5 volt DC power supply. The audio player uses UART protocol to communicate with Arduino Uno board. This module, the um, audio player. So we also need the uh, OLED display, uh, the, uh, the flame sensor, Get for yourself a speaker 20 ohm one uh what what I think what uh one k ohm resistor okay now uh the um there is the SD card okay the disk format should be F eighty sixteen or F eighty uh thirty two okay uh, so we put the uh the df player mini on to on the uh, breadboard okay now we we need uh this 1k um resistor attached attached to the uh, rx pin of the uh, df player mini Welcome to TMAE Education, education guys. Uh, okay, now uh, the uh, RX through this K um, re resistor will be connected to the uh, TX of the uh, Arduino Uno pin three. Define uh, defined um, on the uh, Arduino code. Now the TX of the DF player mini will be attached to the uh, RX of the uh, Arduino Uno pin two defined um, in the code. Okay. Now uh, this is the VCC is going to. Um, this is okay. This is see five volt. Yeah, this is ground. Okay, now we attach the VCC to the uh, five pin uh, to the Arduino pin five volt. Then we have two ground pins on the uh, DF player mini. Uh, the need to go to the uh, need to be ground okay the two ground pins to the uh, ground okay uh, it, it's done okay we, we've just set up the uh, uh, DF player mini with uh, now we set up the the uh, only the display okay vcc to 5 volt
then uh, ground to ground and uh, the pin the the clock pin SCL to Arduino pin analog pin A5 the uh, the data pin SDA to Arduino pin A4 uh, then uh, now the flame sensor three pins on my left side is the uh, the data pin the, the middle pin ground and uh, on my right side is the VCC so uh, this is it. The data pin to pin six to Arduino pin six. So let me just pick uh, a wire for pin six. Okay. So this is pin six. Okay. Now, okay, pin six. Now let me grab another wire for, let me see, uh, this is for ground, ground, let me connect the ground, like that, then, I think, I think I messed up, uh, this is the VCC pin, the data pin is on this side, okay, on my left side. And uh, on my right side is the uh, the VCC. Oh, cool! I think uh, it's almost done. We, we just need to connect the uh, the SD card. Okay, the format should be F A F A T sixteen and uh, or F A T thirty two maximum number of su supported folders is 100 now the um, we, we connect the speaker okay i'm going to show you the uh, schematic okay don't worry before i show you the schematic we we, we need to to create the audio okay to create the audio, you you go to TTS, I think, Maker. You go to this side, and uh, I'm going to use a uh, male voice. Now, to create the, uh, to convert to speech, you need to put the capacha, uh, I think, code. Then it will Your home is burning. The audio for Your home you. is burning. Okay, I use the um, male voice. Then you can download. Okay. Now you rename your audio. Okay, your file audio should start always with two zeros. Okay, I think two zeros, and then comes um, one, one, two, three. Okay, and yeah, then so uh, this is the diagram. And uh, this is the code for this project. Very simple. I'm going to provide in the de description of this video. Okay, cool. Your home is burning. 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 